Wow, will you look at this Camry? Wait, this is a Camry? That's right, this is one of the new trim levels for 2023 Camry. This is the SE Nightshade. We have a brand new color, we've got brand new trims and new options. You can see this reservoir blue color. Wow, I've never seen a Camry color like this. And then you can get it in SE Nightshade front wheel drive, SE Nightshade all wheel drive, and you can get it in SE Nightshade Hybrid. And as far as pricing, the three different configurations, SE front wheel drive is gonna be about 28.4, then for all wheel drive, 29.8, and then 30,600 for the hybrid. It's like famous philosopher David Lee Roth once said, I got it made, got it made, got it made. I'm hot for teacher. Well, Camry, Teach me all about you because you're hot. This has a 2.5 liter four cylinder engine. It's gonna produce what you're used to seeing with a Camry. 203 horsepower, 184 pound feet of torque, matched with an eight speed automatic transmission. But in this case, we're working with paddle shifters as well, just like you'd see in a Camry SE or XSE. So you can kind of tweak it like this, go first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, one, and then. This also has a sport tuned suspension, so it rides more like a sporty car, like you'd see on the XSE and the SE, like this one, and not on the LE or XLE. I don't really remember the artist. You can tell me in the comment section. I can see every time you see through me and it's all over you electric blue. Take a look at this front end. It's got several parts to it. All the honeycomb design like you see in the sportier Camrys has Toyota Safety Sense 2.5 plus. You can see this little horizontal wing right there. I love the color keyed accents here. It's just absolutely incredible and it looks really good with this matte black and the headlight design here. LED headlights, LED daytime running lights. Look at the curvature of the hood as well. It's muscular, it's sporty, yet it's classic and deserving of the best-selling mid-size sedan in the country, you like my shadow, for the last 20 years. So now the real question is, what's more iconic? These 19-inch matte bronze alloy wheels or my Star Wars socks? Look at these wheels on the plane. So yeah, take a look at these 19-inch wheels. What a show it's putting on here. Toyota symbol, standing proud and tall. Now look at the wheels on the profile. Part of the profile is just looking at what starts at the back and works its way to the front, sort of like a mullet. Not really, but I just wanted to say mullet. But anyway, look at those wheels. Look at the rockers down below that jut out. Color keyed handles. Got the black outline of the windows. This is smart key push button start because it has the convenience package. Normally it would have a key. So remember, you need the convenience package if you want that. Look at this, we've got the gloss black side mirrors. We do have turn signal indicator here. We have blind spot monitor, but only because we have the blind spot monitor upgrade. So don't expect this unless you get the blind spot monitor and rear cross traffic alert, RCTA upgrade. I'll show you the pricing when I show you the window sticker at the end. Let's take a look at the back. I see single exhaust with dual chrome pipes, diffuser, most of it's color keyed. Then we have some black accents, SE, Camry. If it was all wheel drive, it would say all wheel drive. And then look at this cool rear lip spoiler. It's pretty nifty. Hey Camry, you're pretty nifty. How do you do it? And then looking inside, no, let's go up top. This glows in the dark, so if somebody locks themselves in or horrible situation like carjacking or something and you're in the trunk, it glows, you can open up the trunk, get out of that situation. Really good safety feature. I wish more people knew it existed. Hopefully nobody's ever in that position. All weather, cargo tray, look how tall it is. That can hold a lot of liquids if something were to leak. Right? That's pretty cool. So let's go underneath here. All right, so we've got right in here, 
soundproofing, spare tire, shaboom. If I want to lower those seats, I pull the pins and then this is going to be kind of crude, so we're vlogging. Okay, so now as we back out, you can see what you can open up for space. Oh, I got to fix that. All right, how's that look? This is Softex and Sport Fabric Seating, the insert in the center. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Roll Pop? One, two, three licks. But so see, it's very different there. This is what the dash looks like with that seven inch multimedia screen. Here's what it looks like from the back row. And then in the back seat, camera's always known for having a good amount of headroom, good amount of leg room as well. You can see it's got a place for sport bottles. It's a little bit of a soft touch, not hard. It's not soft you'd probably be okay with it. And then we've got more sport bottles here. Just like that, I like that. Light stitching that matches the seat inserts. And then this right here, every Camry trim has some sort of defining accent piece here. Could be completely different from what you see, but this is the metallic one. What do we have in here? Well, we've got eco mode, normal mode, and sport mode. You do have storage in here. It's not wireless charging. Sometimes you see that on top of there. It has right here, dual temperature controls, holla. And then this is a touch screen right here that gives you Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. It's not wireless, just saying. It's not wireless. Sirius XM though. I like that. Got us some USBs, a leather wrapped steering wheel, auto dimming rear view mirror. Just showing you the things I think you might be interested in. This one has LED lights on it, sunglass holder, and then these are sliders. We'll do this the opposite side than I normally do, but we've got lighted mirrors with Slider function, whoop whoop, White Castle sliders. Our friend passenger seat does not have power operated controls. However, manually you can raise the roof and raise the seat. And here's a look from the driver's side. If we look up top Girl Scout, you'll notice that it does not have a moonroof. The seats are very comfortable actually, and I suspect that they'll last a long time. Lumbar support, you can go up down you can twist it and then back so let's look over here sport bottles just like that here's our window sticker we got to learn more right se nightshade this is front wheel drive made in georgetown kentucky reservoir blue how cool is that to see reservoir blue for the first time this one averages 32 up to 39 on the highway We'll look at standard equipment, then I'll show you some factory options and then regional options. Here's our safety and performance. Exterior and interior in the house. This is 28485. Look at the options. Blind spot monitor, rear cross traffic alert, convenience, smart key, home link, auto dimming rear view mirror, 600 each. Get it delivered and then we've got plain Safe travels, woo! And then we've got some options added at the regional assembly port. You'll get some options, lots of options, no options. It's up to your dealer, your region, and you. This one here is 32433. As always, thanks everybody for watching. I really appreciate you being part of my channel where you can leave your thoughts, your comments, and your opinions about vehicles like this. Thanks for joining. Subscribe, yes! And then we've got Auto Jeff Reviews, that's my second channel, looks at all brands, Toyotas, and everything. Auto Jeff Reviews there. And I'm on Instagram and TikTok, Toyota Jeff Reviews, Auto Jeff Reviews. So what do you think of Camry? Do you like this reservoir blue color or throw it out the window? You tell me, would you buy this? Do you like the wheels? Do you not like the wheels? I gotta know it all. So thanks everybody, see you next time. When doves cry.